today we are going to talk about AI image generator application. We will build an application and it will generate images with OpenAI. If you are not subscriber, please subscribe and learn new no-code tools with me. We will start with setting API. Please go to platform section in OpenAI website. I will put the link in description. Find image generation section. We need to be sure that our library is curl. Now copy API URL. Great, come back to Fruity Flow and go to API page. Click add and choose create API call. Give it a name. Method type will be post. API URL will be the link which we copied from OpenAI website. Paste it here. Now we will add two headers to our API call. One will be content type, other will be authorization. We will take them from OpenAI website. I am showing you now. Now we will need a key. You must create account after that you can access for creating key. Click API keys. Click create new secret key. Give it a name and click create secret key. Now we are copying the key. Great, we will paste it to the header one which is authorization better. Now we will set body part. Type will be JSON. Back to OpenAI and copy the section which includes prompt and number. Prompt means what would you like to draw on OpenAI. Our users will enter it on text field and we will send it with prompt. And means how many images do you want to draw and user will choose it on drop down widget. For size section, I will not change, but if images have big data, it will take time to upload images to application. So copy it and after that paste it on JSON. We will delete these parts on JSON. Now we must define variables for our JSON because we want our users to decide with their requirements and these informations must be entered by them. So click variables. Add two variable. One will be prompt, other will be number. Type of prompt will be string, type of number will be integer. Let's back to body section. Okay, we will drag prompt and number to JSON. That's it. Now let's test our API. Fill the variables and click the includes checkbox for both. I will ask AI to create a penguin job to poo. I will also want three variants. Okay, let's click test API call and after that create JSON path at the same time. Great, we get images from AI as URL. Now we will define our JSON path for setting image path from dynamic children. So you can do as manually, but I suggest you to use Flutter Flow recommendation. Click recommended and select URL. Back to selected and give it a name for JSON path. Great, now we have done here. Okay, we built API part now. We will set actions for button. Click the create button. Select action part and add action. Find API call. Choose the API call name. Click add our variables. For prompt, it will come from our text field. So click value, widget state and text field. For number, we must use custom function because output of dropdown is string. 
but we will need integer so we must convert string to integer i already created the function and you can find it on my discord channel or you can create it on codex part if you need help in this part you can comment below and i will help you about this so click value choose custom function input will be widget state drop down now we have just defined our variables i will also give a name on this action because we will use this action output for generating dynamic children now choose the drag view or create view this part is on your hand click generate dynamic children give it a name value will be action output api response option will be json body available option will be predefined path predefined path name will be the path we created in the section on api part click the name and confirm all now we will set image url from api call select image click path choose the name of dynamic children that's it now we can test our application Thank you for watching, I will focus more AI application in next videos. I will also develop this app project with new features and you can purchase this template on my website if you're interested with project. If you want to see this kind of content, please subscribe to channel and like the video. You can ask everything so don't hesitate to comment below. See you in next video.